Okay, in unit number eight, we're going to learn the structure have to in questions. Here we've got some examples. Do teachers have to wear a uniform? The affirmative answer will be yes, they do. And the negative answer will be no, they don't, which is the correct answer in this case. Let's say a few more examples of questions. Do vets have to go to university? Yes, they do. Do nurses have to work at night? Yes, they do. Do teachers have to wear a uniform? No, they don't. Here we've got some other examples. Here we've got two vets, so let's make a question. Do vets have to wear a uniform? As we can see in this picture, the answer is affirmative. Yes, they do. Here we've got a lawyer. Let's make a question. Do lawyers have to wear a uniform? No, they don't. Another example, here we've got a waiter. Do waiters have to wear a helmet? No, they don't. One more example. Here we've got two artists. Let's make a question. Do artists have to like art? Yes, they do. So let's remember, for making questions, we use do for I, you, we and they. And we use does for he and she. So, for example, do I have to wear a uniform? Do you have to wear a helmet? Do we have to go to university? Do they have to work very hard? Does he or she work at night? Okay, see you soon.